Hi, I'm Nikki Lucy, Director of Nursing and Quality here at Dorset County Hospital. So we're going to talk flu. Last year we did really, really well, but we can do so much better. Most people in the Trust got their flu vaccination. This year we want even more. We want all our staff to vaccinate themselves, protect their friends and their family and themselves. So some myth busting. Flu vaccine can give you the flu. It's not true. Flu vaccine is not a live vaccine. It cannot give you the flu. If you already are carrying the flu virus or cold virus or any other virus, you will still continue to have whatever that virus is in your system. The flu vaccine helps protect you against flu when you are not already carrying it. Therefore, it's really important to get your vaccine. Another myth. Oh, well, actually, one of the problems with the flu vaccine is um, it's not really effective. It doesn't really work. And I got the flu vaccine last year and I had a really, really bad case of the flu. Usually what we find is this is all myth. Now, as I said, you could already be carrying the virus, but also you can have a really heavy cold. That's not flu. Flu is very very serious illness. You can be bedridden, you absolutely do not feel like doing anything, even eating and drinking. A heavy cold is just that. It's a cold. You will get over it. Flu, you may really struggle in getting over. We know last year and previous years and our knowledge from Australia recently in their flu um, season, showing that a lot of people who get flu can be admitted to hospital and also potentially intensive care unit. There's a reason why our critical care unit is so brilliant at having the flu vaccination. It's because all of our anaesthetists, intensivists and staff in the critical care unit see the consequences. Flu is not a heavy cold, it is a serious illness. So protect yourself, protect your family and protect our patients. When should I get the flu vaccination? Well, now. Our board were brilliant. And as soon as the vaccine arrived into the organisation, our board went on and got their flu vaccination. We felt it was really important to role model, look after ourselves, not pass on any disease to our patients and our other staff and get on and have the flu vaccination. So if you haven't had it, go and get it now. There's also lots of myths about what's in the flu vaccine. Actually, there's a simple questionnaire for you to fill it out. Um, it doesn't take five minutes and the staff that are doing the vaccinations have been trained to make sure that they check for any allergies that you've got in case there's any issue with your flu vaccine. The most important one really is have you reacted to it before badly and if so then they'll advise you and also it has um, egg protein in it and they'll just check you're not allergic to that. They also will make sure that if you're of a certain age that you need to look at an alternative flu vaccine, they'll advise you to go to your GP to get that. It's really that simple. What else can I tell you about flu? Well, actually, you can be a carrier of flu and you can pass it on to patients and staff without necessarily having the full symptoms of flu. Therefore, it's one of the key things to remember that you may say, well, I'm OK, it never affects me, but you could pass on the virus to other people and it could really affect them. So do the responsible thing. Do what most people do in the trust and get your flu vaccination.